Hi, I'm Laura Parker with Stones of Change in Wilmington, North Carolina. I'm here to talk to you today about some of the ways you can use amber for healing. What you'll need is to find yourself a reputable holistic practitioner. Amber is a fossilized tree resin and uh, is absolutely millions and millions of years old. And as it was forming, little bugs and critters got in it and they say, the ancients say, that the amber, since it is millions of years old, that it houses ancient wisdom and that the bugs are just an additive, uh, an added benefit to it. Now, there's a not so old amber, which is maybe only a million years old, and it's called copal. And it comes in like a golden color, an orange color, and a lot of people are using it for um, transmuting negative energy into positive energy. So you'll see a lot of healers from the different cultures wear amber necklaces or amber bracelets because it's infused with healing properties from the ancients. Well, you can always wear it in jewelry. Uh, it's a little bit more difficult for me to find. So uh, when I do find it, I usually have someone put it in jewelry for me if they can. And But it's very soft, so it's not jewelry that you're going to be able to wear every day because on the hardness scale, it may be about a four. And it doesn't react well to a lot of heat and if you're around a lot of hot things, you don't want to wear it because it's going to ruin it and take the beautiful finish off of it. Uh, it's very soft. It's, it's kind of gummy. And so, you know, you could wear it in jewelry if you'd like, or you could, there's little pyramids that you can buy now. There's a lot of different things you can buy that are made from amber. And I like the little things you can set around the house, which are little pyramids. I have some spheres, amber spheres, that I just set like in little egg things. And they're really cool because you can see the bugs in them and the uh, flora and fauna from millions of years ago that's stuck in there. And, uh, but as far as the healing, you know, just like the other stones, you can put a piece in your pocket, you can put a piece on a pendant, uh, stick a piece in your shoe, whatever you feel comfortable doing, you know, you're going to absorb the benefits from it because it is very porous and it's uh, organic. So it's not uh, like a rock because it is a living thing. It was living at one time and it has stored that in it. So, you know, it's kind of neat to have that. And that's how you would use amber for healing.